It's like, you know, like a 20 minute interview type thing. Oh my God, 147 people on. Fuck. All right, no party today, guys. I want to do woo today a little bit. Just a little bit of woo. A little, 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 like, you know? Oh, I gotta, I gotta launch this differently because my shit's scuffed. One second. Oh, I gotta open up TeamSpeak as well. I always forget that part. Connected. User joined your channel. User left your channel. User left your channel. Guys, I, I know, but I have to be somewhere tonight. I have to be somewhere tonight. I can't. I can't. I, I, I literally, I would bail. I would actually bail and just play Red Dead, but I can't. Woo and you soon? Oh, I'd really be sick if his name was you, actually. Okay. We saw this already. I said, Bug Barty. He a shardy. Short but shardy. Bug Barty. You too little. You can't party. Fuck Barty. Fuck Barty. You's a bitch ass boy. Oh my <laughs> God. Fuck. <laughs> oh, that food smells good. What are you eating? Huh? That smells fire. Holy shit. Boys, we have 15K subs too. Good viewership today. Sheesh. I always have to remember how to do Wu's voice, bro. That was fully released now. So much fun. I also want to check that out. But tomorrow's wipe day on Rust, boys. So do we always start? Do we always start and end with that one song that I really like? Why not? All right, intro mode. Intro mode. Fuck, I feel so tired. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Who the hell was that? I love this song.
Oh, uh, dude, I fucking regret not playing earlier because I have to go soon, man. Sorry, I'm telling my brother idiots in my chat. Sorry, I'm texting my brother. Cancel your plans, we move more important. I, I literally can't chat. I can't. Now, how do we get a hold of Antonio? <clears throat> Dude, Abby's food smells so good. It's driving me fucking crazy. No, I don't want to bite because now I'm going to be so hungry. I regret ordering pierogies after smelling what the fuck, whatever the fuck you just ordered. All right, let's go. My AD's name is Tommy Corleone. I know, dude. It's actually so funny. All right. So where can we send a telegram? Wagon, stable, post office. Even know his telegram? Oh, I actually have to know his telegram. This is sick. What the fuck? Damn, so I should have run down his telegram earlier. How do I get my telegram? Is this mine? EI 571. The ink bottle is sick. Enterprising individuals in here for a business for a budding. This is in the heartlands. If you have initiative, 
and the will to build something to stand a test of time and make a tidy profit contact below tommy cooper that's sick you can just leave shut up like that I actually love this horse. It sucks that it's not good. It's fine, just not fast. I mean, as long as it's like decent. Let's go to the saloon. See if we can ask where uh, where Tony is. Am I dying? What's wrong with my car? Oh, he's patting him. Guys, the best place to ask people is always the saloon, man. I'll never get over the graphics of this game. Oh, we could go to the Italian guy's house, actually. That's a better idea now that we remember where it was. Hmm. Let's see if we can find it. Oh, those are actual people. Oh, I think it's right here. Is it right here? That might be it. No, this is definitely not it. I've, wait, I remember the uh, the field there where Tony knocked me out. Can we go in here? Who spread over the floor? Ew. Yeah, I remember this field here. I remember the field. This is where we got knocked out. Oh, that's the house right there. That has this has to be the house right here. This is it. Is this it? Oh, it is it. There's a horse here. This thing looks so fucking good. I'll never get over how good it looks, bro. Is there a way to knock? I don't know if we should be doing this, but fuck it. Oh God. Oh God. Oh fuck. There's gotta be a way to knock, right? Guys, I'm not just going to go into their house, man. That's not how it works here. Fuck it, we'll do this. Oh, here it comes. <laughs> Hello. Is my team speak fucked? 
Hello. <clears throat> I'm here to see Antonio. <laughs> oh, is that Mr. Wu? Yes. Um, I don't think Antonio's here at the moment. Do you know where he is? I just woke up, man. I have no idea where anybody is. I'm sorry, I can't help you. Do you know how I can get a hold of him? When was the last time you talked to him? It's been a few days. I've been sick. I love this guy so much. Um, well, I don't have his telegram number, so I can't help you with that. Uh, do you have his telegram number? I do not. Aren't you like his brother or something? From another mother? Long lost, yes. Right. So I, <laughs> I would assume you had his telegram number. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I'm not familiar with what uh, telegram is. You don't know what a telegram is? No. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's, um, why don't we go take a walk, you and I, Mr. Mr. Wu. Okay. <laughs> I gotta walk with the most scariest guy that he's met? Oh, God. <laughs> so, a telegram, essentially, is like a piece of paper with a message on it. Now, I don't really know how it works, but, you know, you can um, type, you can write something out, and uh, some other person is going to, like, um, like a letter. Like a letter, but then they send some sort of, I don't know, like, ele electronic signal or something with, like, electricity and stuff. And then somebody else gets it somewhere else, and then they write down what the other person sent. And then, I don't know how it works exactly, but it's essentially like a little message you put in a letter. I see. So I'm assuming you don't know your own telegram number? I did it even though I had one. Okay, well, we're going to go find that out. Because it's important to keep in touch with people, Mr. Wu. That you uh, give people your telegram number. And you take theirs down as well, huh? That's important. I see. I don't really like people. Oh, neither do I. <laughs> Yeah, we're rolling with the big boss, bro. So, um, you and Tony go, uh, real far back, huh? From what I understand. Yes, I first met them when I came here to America. How long ago was that? I'm not so sure. Uh, years, maybe. Mm hmm. Back in New Orleans, yeah. After. After New Orleans, okay. Yes. I see. Okay. So, Tony... Where did you come from before America? Uh... <clears throat> I came from the Amazons. <laughs> I don't have a backstory, bro. <laughs> the Amazons? Yes. <laughs> like in... Like in South America? Correct. Okay, okay. Is no, we gotta improvise, bro. Much better than here. Less people. Less people, more trees, yeah. Yes. But you, are you from the Amazons? Like, you, you were born in the Amazons, then? It is correct. I see, okay. So why'd you leave that uh, beautiful place with less people and come all the way to America full of fucked them people everywhere? My father was an inventor. Came here to help build the uh, railroad system. Oh, okay. That's, that's interesting. The uh, railroad is the future. Really moves society along. It's an important invention. Okay. Father, father must have been a, uh, an important man. Or a piece of shit. Okay, sure. Daddy issues, that's okay. I got daddy issues too. Disowned me. Really? Yes. Right, mine, mine ain't that bad. Okay, so what you do to have him disown you? I'm no inventor. So what, you, could, you couldn't invent something to change the world and so he what, threw you out? 
Yes, he brought me here to learn and help. But I saw a different world. I see. I see. That's harsh. That's harsh. I'm sorry to hear that. Don't be sorry. I'm happier. Ah, well, good riddance then, huh? Yes. It was a piece of shit. <laughs> I believe you. <laughs> so how are you finding uh, Saints Crossing so far? I hate it here. Because of the people? The smell. The people. Everything. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, I'm sure you'll... Uh... You'll find uh, you'll find something to like eventually. So hey, take a look. T talk to the teller here now. He'll, he'll give you your telegram number, okay? Make sure you write that down. You memorize it. I see. E one oh E I five seven one. E I five seven one. Hold on, let me write that down. E as in um, I don't know Eugene. Yes. I as in invention. Yes. Funny. But I was trying to be funny. Uh, EI what? 571. 571. EI 571. Okay. Okay. Well, I've uh, written that down. So what does that mean now that you know this? That means if you don't pay me $500 in a week's time, <laughs> bad things are going to happen. Don't owe you money. <laughs> You do now. <laughs> see that? That was me trying to be funny. Um, you see? I yeah. see. Okay. I was very right. confused. It's okay. Look, I know it don't mean nothing. It just means that if I ever need to reach out to you, I could write you a quick telegram. But you gotta, you gotta make sure that you visit these offices regularly, right? That there's one here in Saint Denis where we're standing. There's one in Valentine. There's one in Rhodes. Uh, there's some in between towns. You just gotta make sure you visit them, huh? Check your mail. I see. The world wants to move so fast. Things are not, not like how they were before. Absolutely not. The world's moving very fast, Mr. Wu. We gotta learn to move with it. Or live in the Amazons alone. Or do that, yeah, but that, uh, yeah. Okay, I mean, sure, I'm more of a city guy, but all right. Can you be? What is fun here? In the city? Yes. Well, we got a casino boat right over by the uh, the docks. Um, we got a saloon where you can you know have a drink and play some poker. Um, you can sharpen a stick, uh, throw pebbles. Um, you can roll dice. That's a little. That's a little better. Uh. I like to sit down sometimes and watch grass grow. Um, you would like the Amazons? I would love the Amazons, yeah. I would love, love the fucking Amazons. Oh, yeah. Lots of grass. Sometimes I uh, paint my walls and I just... I watch the paint dry. And that is boring. <laughs> Not quite like grass growing. Definitely less fun. <laughs> Now listen, you make your own fun in the crossing. That's the way it works, Mr. Wu. You gotta every get out time there. I come here, darkness follows me. There's no fun here. What do you mean darkness follows you? What the fuck does that even mean? Have you not heard the stories from Antonio? You're, you're better than Rick. Rick oh, let's get out of this story. Oh, hey, Wu. Hey. Yes. Hey, Wu, how's it going? I'm going to check my telegram. It's going all right. All right. Hey, quick question for you. Yes. Listen, yeah, uh, the other day, because um, I'm actually going to write Antonio a very angry letter because he decides not to uh, respond to people. Uh, speaking of Antonio or yeah. Tony, wherever the hell, does he does he have a knack for ditching people? Yes. Tony All right, does. yes. Yes, it seems so. Uh, we were going on a hunt trip just yesterday, and uh, or the other day before, or something like that. Did you have fan mail? And... Uh, well, we were in Valentine. He told me, hey, wait a little bit. I'm going to talk to my friend Rennie, which is his girl or some. I'm not sure. The woman he's in love with. Uh, yes, I'm sure. Something like that. 
He's like, hey, Jim, wait here in Valentine. Go ahead and gamble a little bit. I'll be right with you. I said, chill. Why not? 45 to, to an hour, 45 minutes to an hour later, nowhere to be seen. Not a single side of him at all. And I wrote, I wrote him something uh, two days ago. He hasn't written me back, so I want to write one again. And uh, You are better off following another man. <clears throat> yes, it does seem that way. Uh, so, you know, it seems Antonio's like he has a knack cursed. for that. That is all he will bring you. Right. Well, in that case, okay. Uh, well, thank you. I was just wondering if he has a knack for that because, you know, he told me the other day, uh, we were sitting up there at the thing, he's like, uh, well, Jim, uh, you know, you're one of my good friends, and I suppose a woman's more important than a friend, I guess. Or something. I would not disagree with that logic, personally. Well, I mean, it makes it, you want to lose a friend over, you know, a lady that you like. A love with a woman is greater than a friendship with a man. Or a friend. Or whatever you're into. Fair enough. All right, well, I was coming over here riding something, saw you, and wondering if you had a knack for that kind of thing. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let you go. I just, uh, but you know, what? apparently what you say is right about him. I, I don't know. Just kind of, kind of annoyed me. Life is better without Antonio. Now, do you have his telegram? Uh, y yes, I do. Yeah, please have it. Oh. Sure. Are you ready to write it down? I do not have a notepad. Well, it's going to be pretty damn hard to remember that thing that you... I have uh, no memory. Okay. Well, the, uh, the telegram, and uh, you seem like your friend of the right's going to write it down. That'll be S-E, so like Southeast, uh, 317. SE317. SE317. Not a problem, Will. Uh, hey, you still thinking about that whole living up in the mountains bullcrap? I would rather you not insult what I want. Pardon me. I thought you were, uh, you know. I still think about living in the mountains, Will. Yes. I will one Understood. day. Understood. Understood. Well, uh, Take it easy, Will. I'm not going to bother any more time. I'm just going to write a letter to him and then letter to uh, Daisy, and then I'll be on my way. But I just, like I said, her just wanted to ask you about it. No problem. Thank you, Good Will. luck on your journey. Thanks, Will. You see what I mean? Right, well, there you go. Uh, look, by the way, if you're going to write a telegram, uh, you got to do it back there. I will contact Antonio at a different time, but... That is the reason why I hate this place. Well, all right, let's walk and talk. I'm going back to the house. Come on. <laughs> so, I, you know, I heard you say all these things about Antonio. You hate him and, you know, he's not a trustworthy man. Or, you know, he's not to be followed and whatnot. Tell me more. Antonio is trustworthy, but he eats more or tries to eat more than he can. <laughs> How so? What do you mean? Explain yourself. He sees the world how I see it, but sometimes he wants to skip steps to get there. You're being really vague here, Mr. Wu. Okay, well, what does that mean? He wants to skip steps to get there. What? So he, um, he does what? What does that mean? I mean, I'm not sure how to explain it. It's the appetite for more, but not the patience for it. So he's impatient. Mm -hmm. Yes. And you've seen him do this with the, uh, throughout your experience with him? Can you give me an example? <laughs> I feel so bad, but I gotta stick to the character. I mean... A. It's hard to say. I'm not trying to drag Antonio's name through the mud. And if it were my decision, I would not be following him. That's all I can say. So it's not your decision to be following him, but you are following him then, yeah? I pledge my loyalty. My word is my honor. You pledge your loyalty to a man that you say is impatient 
and, and skips around things so he can get to a final result faster. But these are things I found out after the fact. After you pledged loyalty to him? Yes. So why did you pledge loyalty to him to begin with, then? Like I said, we see the world in the same picture, but... And I thought we could achieve that together. Hmm. And this is really important to you, your pledge of loyalty to Antonio, then? I pledge my life. And you no matter how... Your life. And no matter how much... I wish I would have not done that. My word is my own heart. So you, you're taking this, what, to the grave then? Is that, is that what I'm understanding, this pledge? No matter what Antonio leads you to, you're going you're gonna to stick to him, and, and even if it means you're dead, you're just going to go yes. along with it? My honor means more to me than my death. That's a bit extreme there, Mr. Wu. And that is why I hate this place. To me, that is a way of life. It sounds like you maybe um, shouldn't pledge your life to other people, so you say this uh, nonchalantly. Hmm. Maybe you should think twice about it. Not I'm not sure this word, but... Oh, shit. <laughs> What's going on, Annie? Hey, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> hey, Danny, how you doing? Hey, how's it going? Hello. <laughs> It just means you should think about these things. If you're really pledging your life to somebody, literally to death do you do you two's apart, like you're getting married or some shit. You gotta think about it, Mr. Wu. Sounds like you made a bad decision. I might have regretted it now, but in that time, it was the right decision. If you say so. Yes. All right. Well, uh, nice seeing you. I think your horse is by the house. Feel free to stop by and grab it. But uh, I'll probably be seeing you around later, huh? Ciao, ciao. It was a pleasure. <laughs> Take care, <easy. laughs> Dude, that was such a good conversation. Holy shit. I fucking love that. That whole family, dude, is just... Oh, I wish I started Red Dead earlier, man. I have to go in half an hour, Chad. I'm pissed. day tomorrow so like i said the thing is the server picks up like like two three hours from before now so we're always usually going to start with gta well like i said uh Wu, Wu was built on honor like he, he's not he's never going to abandon I take this from like all the Viking shows I watch, right? Where there's like that character that wants to leave his leader, but he can't and he stays loyal no matter what. That's Wu. And the only way he'd ever leave Antonio is if Antonio freed him over that bond, right? Loki and Ragnar. Yeah, same type of idea. Yeah. Is Wu still Chinese? His father is from China. He's an inventor. That's the lore we literally just made up. But uh, his mother is from the Amazons. That's why he's not sped up to America. America to him is just insanely ahead. Like, I mean, even till this day, the Amazons are way behind. But I don't know where the house is. <laughs> I think it's this way. <laughs> But Antonio, did they earn that pledge, though? Uh, this happened years ago. Like, we're going off of the... So, back in the day when Red Dead first came out and it was scuffed as fuck, me, Tony, and uh, Sodakite, like, we played it. And it was only, like, 30 slots, right? But we actually ended up having an insane time and a crazy story. I can't remember all of it, but... Uh, right, yeah, Red Dead 2. This was, like, a year ago, two years ago, something like that. Remember the day of uh, the Samsung bits? The favorite, my favorite day ever where Samsung fucked up and allowed people to multi sign up with emails just to farm bits and oh my god was that a good day. God that was such a good day.
and people were dropping like 20k bits, 50k bits. It was crazy, bro. The guys are trying to apparently get server. Yeah, but the thing is, like, I'm not gonna force lore on people, right? Like, uh, I don't know what Sodakite's plans are when she does play on the server, so I'm not gonna play like, like Wu remembers her, but he's they don't really have a relationship anymore. So if he sees her, it's not gonna mean much to him unless she takes the initiative, right? Like, that's the important thing about like creating lore. You don't want to force it on people. Dude, I feel bad saying those things, man, but that's what I love about the server. It, I don't know how to explain it. It just feels way easier to stick to characters sometimes. And Tony's gonna kill Wu, bro, if he finds out he was talking shit. Was the day night last longer? Yeah, I feel like it was just night, day, and now night again, right? Or has it been night the whole time? It was day, wasn't it? Who seems like you blame Antonio and sabotaging him? Well, the lore that me and Tony made was that we had a job that went bad, right? And we, uh, like, left each other. And then I added lore onto it where Wu thinks that Antonio has his money, which is the only reason he came back. What was it SE371? Southeast 371 or 317? Yes, G. There's a line out here, bro. Can I get some cigarettes while we wait? Damn, I love that I ran, ran into the fucking leader, dude. Because Wu admires... Uh, he doesn't know him that well, but he already admires his Chenzo. That's the thing about Wu. Is he, he, he admires like great leaders and that's what he thought Antonio was, which he could still be. He doesn't know, but in his mind right now, Antonio's a piece of shit. <laughs> Sounds like Lang. That, Wu is completely different from Lang. Like Wu is a follower. He's not a leader and that's how we play him. He's more of a background character. That's why he's even more quiet. Like you guys, obviously you guys mean the anxiety shit, which was true for the first day. But the character overall is just a quiet character. Like even like that one-on-one -on -one is probably the most talking he'll do is when it's usually one-on-one -on -one like that. Where are the cigarettes? Oh my God, I got to remove this from the store, bro. Crackers. But, uh, but yeah, so, but like the way we play Wu, like Lang is an asshole, but he's like empathetic. Wu literally just hates everybody. Now, will that change as the character develops? Sure. Like that's the point. Like you start, you start a character at a certain point and you see the interactions that causes them to change. That's the cool thing about RP, right? Gang to see Wu being part of. Wu wouldn't join a gang because he's pledged his loyalty to Antonio. Hey, 
Horse's name? Uh, Harry. Uh, sorry to hear that. Oh. I, just, I just want to hit you a little bit of a hard truth. Alright, we're gonna send it to both because I don't I don't remember which one it was. Samuels is crazy. Under motherfucker going around asking people why they do crime. I'm trying to when? interview them. Just something to perhaps you know think about. Well, someone's got to talk to them. I do they? Set person. But yes. So on this ladder of crazy, I put you at the top. Wait, you can't. Well, you have to be a I belong message. To my land of work. Yes, sir. Oh, sender is me. <laughs> Money, I see you. Fifty cents. Vision check. Open. Well, lights. Maybe I actually do need some proper glasses. These ones are fake. Oh my lord. And they use them so they can they, they can keep the profile of. Uh, All right. Well, let's hope it's uh. Doctors meant to have good glasses. Both of those. That's the title? Whatever. This dude lost the outlook? Shut up. <laughs> uh, let's go to the saloon and have a whiskey. The thing is, chat, we gotta go soon. So we'll go have a whiskey. He was there, chat it up, and then uh, check the telegram, and then probably got a dip. I, I, I cannot stream past seven. I have to be somewhere, unfortunately. In rest stream? Fuck no, bro. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> oh, here. We go through here. Second channel rest stream? I've been thinking about doing that, man, though. I, I might do that for the wipe tomorrow, because... Mm, I don't want to take a day off just to fucking sit on my chair all day, though. But I do want to stream rest all day tomorrow. I'm not sure what to do. I do the graphics in this game are just so insane, dude. What is happening? What the fuck? Go chill, bro. Yeah, my old channel is Mendo. How do I pat him? There we go. How you doing, sir? Doing okay. Western music, brother. It's a good song, though. Okay, not this song. Hold on. All right, let's leave that. There, how you doing? I'm doing good. You work That's here. Good. Yeah, I do. Can I get you anything? Can I get a whiskey? Yeah, can do. Can do. Dude, the graphics are hey, so good. I like to punch people. They're on to. Aim at his friend, but yes. Well, that's not what he said. <laughs> like, I got kicking his cards in his name, bro. <laughs> So name plan. My name is Wu. Wu, nice to meet you, Victor. 
Yeah, yeah that's gonna be just a dollar. Yes. Give him a, a dollar? Hello, darling. Oh, thank you, Kyla. Thank you. <laughs> Take care, Mr. Wu. <laughs> Oh, I gotta go to this table. I forgot that one's like scuffed. Uh, this is huge. Thank you. Wait, can we change it while we're sitting? Oh, that's good. <laughs> dude, look at the lighting, dude. It's crazy. The fact that I can actually come here and like not. Like, what I hate about Rooster's Rest is I can't go sit down and, like, be like, I'm chilling and eating food. Here, you can literally do that. Is there thunder or fossil? You see, it's not ACDC, man. It's being immersed. Like, sitting in a chair and eating a sandwich that was supposed to be a ramen bowl, like, it's, it's not really that immersive. This is, you know, the reality of it. Here, it's like it's easier to do it because you're burst into Wu just chilling in a bar, drinking a bottle of whiskey, waiting for a telegram from Antonio. You can actually sit there here and be immersed in that. Now, this is why I come to this bar. Yeah, who loves this whiskey, man? That's how he tolerates being in America. That's so good, dude. All right, we'll go check if we send something back. I doubt it, but we'll check. Can we not leave? At the wrong door? Oh, there we go. Leave, bruh. Dude, I hate that I have to go because like like everything is, I love that everything's so slow paced here. And like by the time we meet Antonio, it's gonna be like two, three hours. And I literally have to go in like 20 minutes. Are there cops? There are, there are sheriffs and well, essentially they're not called cops in this time, but yeah. Just come back to RP later, guys. I'm not coming back later, boys. I got shit I gotta take care of tonight and then I'm chilling. Probably playing some rest, going to sleep, stream tomorrow. The server you're playing this on, it's called Wild RP. Really good server, filled with a lot of fucking phenomenal fucking role players, man. Like, every character is just so intriguing. Is RP tomorrow? Tomorrow's a weird day because of, uh,. Of uh, rust, rust wipe, and they're actually pu pushing what seemingly is seemingly a good patch. That's gonna make the game more fun. So, oh god, I gotta walk into his entire family, bro. Don't do that. What's that? Yeah. What Yawning. Somebody yawned. <laughs> Might have been me, I'm not sure. How the this fuck do you die day. yawning, eh? Just, just joking, just joking. I could, I could <laughs> probably die from lack of sleep right now. Yeah, yeah, I get that. Probably get some sleep then, man. Yeah, yeah you sure would, wouldn't you? What the fuck? Is that, that a train? Right? That is a train. Oh, fuck, we should ride a train. Ah. That is definitely a train, yeah. I don't, I don't know. We, we were going to pick up that photo. I'm actually... Yeah. Logs in for one hour, and then Antonio's like, name logs off. Although <laughs> we weren't there, but it was taken. 
Anyways, uh, nice talking to you. Nice to meet you both. Huh? Yes. Nice job. I should have come out and get on the train. Take it easy, all right? Just the move. How you doing? Doing all right. Hmm. I want to go on the train, dude. Train that telegram finally, then. Yes. Waiting on yeah. response. Okay. Okay. It's a fucking train. Hey, baby. Yo, should we hop on it? I kind of want to hop on it. Fuck it. Fuck Antonio, bro. Alright, tickets are $5. I'll just need your name. $5? Do we have that? No, not this one. Yo, we was going to ignore that and just get on the train and cause some ruckus. That's, yeah, uh... <laughs> two passengers, one or two cars. <laughs> <laughs> if you if you paid for your ticket, sir. Yes. <laughs> Can you hear me, sir? I said yes. What is your name? My name is Wu. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I will verify with the registry. <laughs> if you have not paid for a ticket, sir, you are bo trying to board illegally. Whilst I'm gone, will be your opportunity to leave. <laughs> That's some movie shit, bro. What the fuck? Are we dip? <laughs> oh, we, we can sneak on this. We can sneak on this, dude. Oh, my food's here. Pardon me, Miss Davis. Mr. Wu, if you're still on this train, I'll have you know that you're you're stowing away and that's illegal. It's only a five dollar ticket. Dude, that's literally like a fucking NPC fucking script, dude. Find him hiding on the back or something. He's gonna pay. Howdy there. Well, um, pretty decent tickets are five dollars if you'd like to ride. And I, I will need your name. All right. That's so sick, dude. It's so easy to get immersed in this shit, man. It really is. We're gonna try to sneak on, bro, when it takes off. <clears throat> what are you yelling about? Oh, we had a stowaway, but it seems they ran off. They knew it was good for him. <laughs> okay. How many fucking stowaways are we gonna get this train? Oh, no. <laughs> Maybe somebody was right. Maybe I have a criminal pheromone. I don't like the word pheromone. Could you never use it again? Stop. All right, Ed, you and your criminal musk, can you go to the fucking front of the train and get ready to leave? Oh, shit, here we go, here we go. All right, I'll be nice to you because I'm afraid you'll eat me, you cannibal. Did anyone see my hat? I went to sleep with it. Can we climb on top of it? Are you? Like two pants? Like, like camera? <laughs> I don't feel that official without it. If you guys uh, see a train 
a train hat lying around or something. Please return it. They'll either get out of the way or die. All right, last call, last boarding call. Next stop, Valentine. Fuck this. Hey, 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 just make sure to switch the track. Fuck! Hola, senora. What's up, the roof is? God damn it! They hold it down, bro. I want to climb the ladder. Oh shit. going to jail chat <laughs> we also have to go soon so like i want i don't want to get caught up in a jail cell and like feel bad and rush it you know So man, I can't send you so about to get off. Don't worry. We're, we're going to try to do woo earlier. Today, we would have done woo like three, four hours ago, but we just got caught up in a lot of stuff on, on GTA. And then, you know, came on and I want to hang out with him for a little bit. We haven't seen him in a while. Hi, hello there, laddie. <clears throat> oh, God. Have you Hello. seen anyone by have you seen a little flash around, eh? I'm sorry. Have you seen me cousin Flash? I don't know who that is. Oh right, no problem. Right, thank you, fella. Oh man, it's so crazy how quickly we get immersed, dude. I feel like I, I feel like we just started, like ten minutes ago. It's been an hour almost. That's crazy to me.
Oh, oh. shit. That is a beautiful horse. Oh, hello, handsome. Oh, you are gorgeous. Thank you. <laughs> well, I was talking to the horse, but I'm sure you're lovely too. Ending it on that note. Tony, Tony never responded, bro. Fuck. <laughs> she gone? All right, we're good. <laughs> Where he wins again, bro. All right, let's find a place to sleep. Chat, I, I really can't get more into it because if we get sidetracked and I'm late to this shit tonight, it's going to be bad. He's not hot mic if it's red, it's yelling. Yeah, so when it's red, it yells. It looks like hot mic, but it's just yelling. It's, uh, you'll see, like, when the mic gets red like this. That's what I'm talking. Just to keep our ping chat, I've ditched so much shit this week. You guys have no idea. If I could ditch, I actually would ditch. Oh, I can't wait to play tomorrow. <clears throat> okay. All right, boys. Guys, I'm sorry. I only did an hour, guys, but I have to be somewhere tonight. Solid eight and skate today. Really, really good stream. RP today was a lot of fun, too, on GTA. We are really, 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 really close, guys, to 800,000 followers. Please follow the channel. Uh, tomorrow, I really want to try to get a Reddit earlier, man. Fuck. Let's see what Tony's doing real quick. Oh, he's in Valentine. And Tony and Blau are both on, too. The server's fucking full. Fuck. I hate that I'm ending. It's okay. We have it. We have every day. It's fine. I'm fine. Sab's on, too, though. Fuck. God damn it. Uh. Fuck. All right, boys, listen, uh, we'll be live tomorrow, 11 a.m. Pacific. I'm probably taking Friday off. I have not decided yet. Okay. I think that's for tuning in. Thank you for all the subs. Thank you for, uh, for hanging out. Sorry for, uh, you know, I was going to keep going, but uh, I got to go do some shit tonight. Uh, and yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. And then is Anthony Davis gifted you $300, uh, 300 subs? I know, bro. It's crazy. Raid AD. Is he even live right now? He's not even live, bro. All right, let's see. Uh, does that the Chenso guy stream? Does he stream? Or yo, Mendo, go live. I'll host you right now, bro. You got 30 seconds. Let's see. Let's see who's on the Red Dead list I've run into already. Is Mendo live? Let's see. Mendo, you're not live, bro. Night of oh, let's host Moxie. Yeah, Moxie's been great. Is she live?
Uh, what's her channel chat? I don't see it. Nida rules. Let's see. Nida rules. Oh, wait, I spelling that wrong. Nia drools. Sorry, guys, I'm dumb. All right. All right, chat, we'll be live tomorrow, okay? I'll eat my food, chill. And uh, yeah, we'll be live tomorrow. I do want to try to do Reddit earlier tomorrow, man. Fuck, I'm pissed. Love you guys, though, chat. Thank you guys for all the subs, man. Appreciate it. AD, if you're watching, yo. Of course, I, bro. Coming. Follow me on Twitter, please. Thank you. <laughs> Bye, chat. I'll see you guys tomorrow.